But if you are focused, if you are driven, if you are true to your purpose, all the noise around you is just Sir. deafening and you don't even hear it because I know my mission. I hear people say that they don't understand the fullness and how better we are as a country because of our immigrant population. They just don't get it and we all came from somewhere. So if someone tell you to go back where you came from, tell them you will when they go back to where they came from. <laughs> New York is American city. And this Trinidadian population, largest in America, is right here. And we all know that we're going to mash up the pathway. <laughs> but it's more than that. It's what you do every day in the area of education, health, small businesses, dealing with mental health issues, law enforcement. You contribute so much to the city and country. And I'm proud to be here today at the foot of our business district to raise this flag, but also to raise our spirits. We've allowed COVID to beat us down. We've allowed us to feel as though we're not resilient. We are invincible. Our resiliency is unbelievable. And the beauty of our invincibility lies in the uniqueness of this country. It's the only country on the globe where you're told not to abandon your motherland to embrace your new land. You are told just the opposite. Where would we be if we didn't have the diversity of the cultures all coming together to make this unique experience of a humanistic approach of how we live together. We learn from each other. You remove that from the American experience, we're no longer different than any place else. That is our secret weapon. And so today when we raise this flag, we raise our consciousness. We send a message across the country and say, Governor Abbott, you are not representative of what we represent. You are not representative. We're representative of inclusiveness. We're representative of being a city of immigrants and a beacon of freedom. We're representative of understanding how we come together. Just like Trinidad, we're made up of many small islands, but we have a big heart just like Trinidad. <laughs> and when I was in Trinidad and Tobago several years ago, I was blown away about the uniqueness, the friendship, the caring, the loving spirit of the Trinidad people. Even when you pronounce it wrong, <laughs> they still love you. <laughs> and when I had to look up the first time in history, bringing together five women deputy mayors, I looked and said, if I'm going to have the best for the human services aspect of my administration, I need to look towards the Trinidadian community. And I found the amazing Deputy Mayor, William Eisen, to be part of our team. So we are proud to be here together. And grateful you have brought your dreams, ambition, and island spirit here. You have contributed so much to the city, and I want to officially recognize you. So now, I have my, my proclamation. Now as the mayor, come on amb ambassador, come on up. Nothing makes me look better when I'm standing next to two good looking brothers. <laughs> I proclaim Wednesday, August 31st, 2022 in the city of New York, Trinidad and Tobago Heritage Day. I, Eric Adams, mayor of the city of New York. Thank you very much. We all know that uh, the mayor that we have would look good in anything. <laughs> but we think we think red is his best color. Is that right? Yeah. 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 So I'm just going to present this to the mayor. This is uh, 60 years. Yeah, 60 years. It's got two sides. Yeah.
says it says cancel and private. Okay, that's that's TNT. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Come, come, come. How about this from a 90 plus? 90, 91. 91 plus. Yeah. I got day. As he said, pass that God sent down from here. What? This is an angel. Can you pick me this? Ding dong dong, ding ding ding, 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 ding um, we all know that Trinidad and Tobago has the, this is not a boast, okay? This is a fact. Trinidad and Tobago has the best chocolate in the entire world. Now, this, this chocolate is so good. You don't put this chocolate in, in chocolate bars. It has to go in some kind of elite dessert. You know what I'm saying? All right? So this is what I'm going to give you, Mr. And you notice it's in the form, it's in the form of a steel pan. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. And he's got some bandanas. And, uh, Yes, exactly. <laughs> I told you, he looks good in anything. Making the pipe racing ceremony.
Let's get an official photo, please. Bring it. Come on. 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 Come on.
focused, if you are driven, if you are true to your purpose, all the noise around you is just deafening and you don't even hear it because I know my mission.